One of the great things about art is that it connects people and it allows people to express themselves when they're just not ready to express. The Hudgens Center for Art and Learning is focused on visual arts and we reach Gwinnett County and beyond. We really work to be a regional arts center. The Hudgens has a long history of working with nonprofits in the community. We have a partnership with High Hope where we have participants from their day programs come over to the Hudgens and do arts programming. We have opportunities for people who just want to get their hands dirty and do a little drawing or painting or clay. We offer hands-on opportunities for parents with their toddlers. We offer uh, family days where we encourage the whole family to come out. We also have very dedicated sessions where people come in once a week and spend three hours working on projects. The Healing Arts program is a program that is geared towards cancer patients and we encourage people who are just diagnosed to people who have you know, been healed and are now survivors and they come and use that time to kind of escape from their day to day and step outside and be creative. Seven months into my pregnancy, I found out I had cancer. She came on October 15, 2015. Two days later, I went in to have my cancer surgery. After surgery, I started chemo, and then I had um, months of radiation therapy. Um, three months into my treatment, my home burned down. We lost everything. I heard about the healing arts class through Bobby. Bobby works at Gwinnett Medical Center as a volunteer, and I was so glad that she invited me because when I started creating something, it made it more real. There were some emotions that once I, I put them down on paper or you know made some artwork out of them, I was like, wow, I didn't know I had that in me. I didn't know that I felt like that. So it was really, it's a really great program. Just watching what transpires in a class, you would know that your dollars matter. Even in losing the home and losing all the material things and going through cancer, I was still able to look around and count my blessings. The city, the county, the hospital, just everybody around me, they were so beautiful. God's love through their hands, their arms, their love, they reached out to me in so many ways. And my family and I, we couldn't have made it through that time without them. The Community Foundation has been a great partner to us. This year we received funds through the Kistner Endowment Program. We also have the Mary Kistner Atrium where we feature important exhibitions like our annual cup show. My understanding is that she was always a strong supporter of the Hudgens Center and the arts in general and that it was very important to her that the arts continue to be a part of the Gwinnett community. Now that you know we're a little bit past um, the fire and the baby's walking and she's into everything and we're running behind her, I mean there are more hugs, there are more kisses. When you recognize that you know your time is could be could be shortened, then you want to appreciate every moment.